Two empty sports locked out outside of YouTube space, Los Angeles. So here is the thing. I'm going to try to make this as brief as possible. Rashad Johnson, a Cardinal safety, he's 27 years old, suffered by far the most gruesome injury you may ever see. It is certainly the most gruesome in the year 2013. As a matter of fact, he doesn't even know how it happened. Firstly, if you just ate, if you get queasy with injuries, don't look. If you can muster it, here it is. I will be silent as I'm sure you want me to be for a few seconds as you take it in. Here's the photo that he tweeted. As you can see there, his middle finger was shaved down, okay? It was shaved down to his first knuckle. And here's what he tweeted, hashtag the finger. Blessed to be able to still go out and do what I love this season. Hashtag thankful, hashtag truly blessed, hashtag bird gang. He lost the top of his middle freaking finger, and yet he stayed in the game and played the rest of the game. Now, here's the story, according to the Arizona Central, uh, azcentral.com, excuse me. They said that he uh, injured it on a punt return by Darren Sproles. Of course, uh, the Saints won this past weekend against the Cardinals, as you may guess. And he went to the sidelines, he took off his glove, and the top of his finger was still in his glove. It was still there. And yet he still played. Here was his quote. I'm not even sure how it happened. If I had to take a guess, I would say maybe it dug into the turf there and snapped back and broke it that way. My glove was torn or ripped, which makes me think it didn't get caught in a face mask or a cleat stepped on it. He also tweeted at Polly Paps, who of course is of the Dan Patrick Show, saying lost top portion of it, had exposed bone and skin, shaved down yesterday and stitched up. Probably most painful injury I've ever had. So in case some of you guys were thinking, oh, NFL players are pussies. Oh, they're not tough. Rashad Johnson is the definition of tough, and I'm rooting on the Arizona Cardinals from here on. So now I want to hear all of your thoughts in the comments section below. Is this possibly the worst injury you've ever seen? Is it the worst of 2013? Can you give me a worse injury? Maybe I'll put all those together and we could do our own little clip, you and I, back and forth. So leave a thought in the comments section below, and also do me a favor, give this clip a thumbs up, and also hit the top buttons up here and subscribe to TYT Sports.